morning, everyone. Welcome to Desert Isle Crafting. I'm Christy. Hi. Hello. Hi. How are you? I hope you all are having a great day and that you're doing well and that you're having a lot of uh, fun crafting, making some beautiful projects. Today, what I have for you is a cross stitch kit from Paint Some Way. And I will have a link for Paint Some Way down below. It's only one kit, but I saw this kit and I was just like, I have to have it. I just have to have this this picture. It was it's just absolutely beautiful. But before we start, I'd like to say hello to all my subscribers and my new subscribers. Thank you so very much for liking my channel. And if you like this video, hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed, please think about subscribing. I changed my intro. I'm trying to make some changes to the channel. Please let me know what you think. Um, I'd like to know if I'm going in the right direction or not. So let's get going with this um, cross stitch kit from Paint Some Way. Now, as you can see, this has got a lot of floss. This is a big kit. So excuse the crinkling noise. I'm going to try to get this open. Okay. Put this aside and I'll show you the picture. Well, we got the directions. No picture. Hopefully it's on here. Okay, here's a small one. This is a lion picture. And if I can download the picture from the website and put it in a corner of the video right over here, I will do it so you can see it better. But it is this incredible lion. I'll try to get it up a little bit closer. I saw him and I just absolutely love him. Love him. Now this is a big one. It is 203 stitches across by 290 stitches down. So let's look at the pattern first. This pattern is the biggest printed cross stitch pattern I have ever had in a kit. This is an 11 count, but look how big it is. It's, I don't even think I could show you the whole thing. Let's see. The pattern is massive. It is huge and I am so grateful for that. Now it doesn't come with a QR code. It is totally gridded on the sides and on the top. I'm going to have to fold it back in again. <clears throat> the pattern is very clearly printed. And I'm going to hold up the, unfold the pattern, I mean the actual canvas in a minute, and see if the pattern is as big as the canvas. But as you can see, there are a lot of places for color blocking. Here where they give you the number. There is a lot of confetti too. It has 40 colors. So 40 colors for just that lion. I think the contrast and the detail is going to be gorgeous. This is so big. Wow. I'm just shocked, really. Now they also give you a nice little instruction page with diagram, how to rinse all the, the ink out of your material after you get it all stitched up, how to find the right floss to use. Now we would use three strands of floss on this project, so I'm glad they um, gave some some um, instructions. I wish they would have given an actual printed picture and I'm going to suggest that to them. We also have a nice little toolkit. This is a generic kit. It doesn't have a manufacturer name on it. So this is a nice little reusable bag. I saved these. They're great for diamond painting. We have how many needles? We have five needles. We have a threader and we have an adjustable th thimble, which I like these because I poke myself all the time. So let me get this back in the bag. Okay, now let's look at the actual canvas itself. It is stiff, but it's not super, super stiff. It has your item number up here at the top. Please uh, know that if you need to contact customer service because you're running out of floss or there's a problem with your canvas, 
Make sure you let them know this number. It's a 50 by 70, so I'll get you a measurement on that in a minute. We have the picture of the lion up here in the corner. It's all gridded. And I don't know, I'm uh, thinking that this, this paper pattern is the same size as the actual picture. If you look at it, it's lining up at the top the same. So let me unfold this. It is huge. Let me turn it sideways. Oh dear, so we can see. And yes, the pattern is the same size as the actual picture, which I think is just wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. That makes me really, really happy because like I said earlier, you don't see that very often. So I'm going to put the pattern aside and we'll look at the actual canvas itself. So we have our legend over here. It shows us the number of our floss, the symbol on the canvas, and then the DMC codes. Wow, this is just going to be stunning. Let's see how clearly it's printed. Now it looks to me that the symbols are staying in their squares and not moving over into other squares, which unfortunately sometimes you get, but this is looking really good. Really, really good. And here you got his mouth and all his mane. There's not a whole lot of background. I mean, he is the picture. He is the whole picture. Here's his eyes. Let's look at the floss. Okay. I'm so glad that they bagged this floss up separately too. Now this one doesn't, this bag doesn't have the product number on it. I would write that on here. Just in case they get separated, you know what kit this is going to go to. Or go with, I say. Okay, we have a lot of Hanks here. Of black, brown, rust, another shade of brown. And this is like a really dark brown. Very soft floss. It's all marked with DMC code. So you can find the DMC code over here on your legend. So that 400 would be number 9. And anywhere you see that green, like up here in this corner. So all these hanks are, are marked with the DMC codes. So you know... Now let's look at this floss. Oh my goodness sakes. With 40 colors, it's a lot of floss. It's on two separate cards here. But these are definitely lion colors. We have many, many shades of yellow, gold, orange yellow, light yellow, a lot of rust and brown colors too. There's even like a burgundy color. There's pinks in here. Now that's going to be really interesting with pinks in here. There's light blue. I'm thinking the blue might have something to do with his eyes. Let's flip it over. There's some more blue. Lots of shades of brown and orange like a light orange here, but not real orange, orange. This is beautiful. I think this is just going to be stunning. Now, they didn't write the item number on this either. I would write it on both of these, just to be on the safe side. There is a lot of floss here. So, you will take, like I said before, this is a six-strand floss. You're going to take and divide it uh, in half, three strand little bundles, and that's what you're going to use to stitch. 
you know, I have so many that I have started, and it's going to take me forever to get the ones I have started done. But then you open up something like this that is just gorgeous. And I love lions. I always have ever since I was a little girl. I just think they're so majestic. And you see all this floss, and you see this beautiful, beautiful picture and pattern and how well it's printed on this canvas. And I think, oh my gosh, am I going to start this too? Oh, yeah, yeah. Decisions, decisions. Let's get a measurement on what size this is in inches. 50 by 70 is just so big. Okay, so going across... It's uh, about 18 and 3 quarter inches, maybe, across. And that is 48 centimeters. So if I want to go this way, I don't think you're going to be able to see me measure all of it. Let's see what we have here. kind of bent up, so I want to try to get as true of a measurement as I can. So it's a little over 26 and a half inches uh, vertically. So that's over two feet. This is just a massive picture. And I think this is the only size you could get it in. Um, yeah, it would be great if it was smaller, but I really don't think you would see as much of the detail there is a lot of detail in that lion. A whole lot of detail. He is just beautiful. I, I just love him. And I'm really, really curious and interested to see how he comes alive once you start stitching, once I start st stitching on him. Have any of you got this picture before? I would really like to know and if you did what you thought, how it turned out, if you did get one and you have completed it, send me an email with a picture. I would really love to see what it looks like. Now this picture was $15.99, and I think considering the size and everything you get with it, money well spent. Paint Some Way offers a lot of crafting if you've never been to their website before. You know, the diamond painting, they have uh, lots and lots of cross-stitch. The variety in their inventory is huge. They have a Joy Sunday section. They have a 99-cent section. They have paint by numbers. They have tools. They also have a blind box for diamond painting. So if you like mysteries, and who doesn't like a mystery box, you can order a blind box. And right now they have 70% off shipping for a limited time. If you buy one, you get 8% off. If you buy five, 15% off. Buy 10, 20% off. And buy 25, 23% off. So 70% off shipping is a huge, huge deal because everybody's raised their shipping prices. So I would definitely go to Paint Some Way. I will have their link below along with a link to this kit. I love this kit. Love this kit. And I really like Paint Some Way. Quality products at great prices. I've been uh, buying products from them for a couple years, be way before I even started making videos. I always really love their quality and that's why I kept going back to shop there. So check them out if you can. And like I said, I'll have the links down below. Thank you so very much for watching and please like this video if you like it. Take care, have a wonderful day, and I'll be talking to you soon. Bye.